hey you guys i'm back again with another message and this particular message i know you guys it kind of ties into another message where um god said that told me to deliver that attackers are going to be exposed but this particular message god said exposed in public one number god showed me and i cannot remember the number and i'm trying to sit here and ponder on that number and i'm next time i will when he shows it to me i'm gonna write it down because I went to the stronger coordinates and forgot to write the number down. But he kept showing me this number over and over again. And it's unveil. It means unveil in the stronger coordinates. Like he's un going to unveil and so un un um, unveil and and reveal some things about people. And then last night when I was reading the book of Proverbs, it says how uh, people are going to be wrong people are going to be exposed in public you know and so i'm going to read it and it's proverbs chapter 26 verses 24 to 28 and it reads people may cover their hatred with pleasant words but they are deceiving you they pretend to be kind but don't believe them their hearts are full of many evils while their hatred may be concealed by trickery their wrongdoing will be exposed in public. If you set a trap for others, you will get caught in it yourself. If you roll a boulder down on others, it will crush you instead. A lion tongue hates its victims and flattery words cause ruin. Um, you guys, we're going to see a lot of people being exposed in public. I told you guys a lot of um, God told me he told his children a lot of God's children the anointing their favor the gift over their life rattles a lot of people demons right so and if it's rattling a lot of people demons they have some really hateful and evil ways towards you that they going to be able to no longer be able to contain and a lot of these people are going to be exposed in public all right it's actually going to put them to shame. Thank you, Holy Spirit. And I seen the number the other day. Like I said, I got to start begging to write my numbers down, y'all. And it meant shame. Some of these people are going to be put to shame because by being exposed in public, because their true intentions and their true heart posture is going to come out. And they can no longer fake the funk of who they are. They can no longer fake the funk about how they feel about certain people. Because we do have people that pretend. We do have people that sit up here and put on the front like they are so loving and they're so giving and they're so understanding and they care about people. When deep down they hate, they, they can't stand a person, right? They have, they, they hate someone. Like they have, they are carrying hatred in this, their heart for a person that's a very very dangerous person to be around y'all where you have someone that's in your in your face in your presence pretending that they love you pretending that they like you when deep down they hate you deep down they can't stand you deep down they want they wishing the worst for you those are the main people y'all the main main people that will go and do witchcraft on you that will go and do rituals on you that will try to do destiny swaps that will even try to discourage you from doing what god has caused you to do to try to make it seem like you're crazy to try to make it seem like you're doing too much it's gonna it's, it's something is gonna happen that's gonna cause them to be exposed and they're gonna be exposed in public because not only are you gonna see it, other people are gonna see their true intentions too and they're gonna be embarrassed they're gonna be ashamed all right and this is a good thing um before every divine elevation y'all is a separation so granted yes it might be hard granted yes it might be hurtful but it's going to be an eye opener because this next level that god is walking his children into in this season in this hour these people can't go you don't need to take the devil with you where into your promised place you don't need to take the devil with you in your promised land and these are hidden judases these are people who have really been probably been in your life for years and you're fine trying to figure out why nothing is not working out why why is all everything that i try to do is never working out why do i feel like i'm being hindered why do i feel like i'm being stagnant especially if you're telling this person all the stuff that you got going on it's because these people that you're probably around is truly an enemy and they don't want what's best for you they're praying against the prayers that you are praying Y'all had had that happen to me before. I was praying for one thing, but another person that was so my so-called friend was praying that I didn't get it, get certain things. And then when I realized their heart posture towards me, 
I didn't cut ties from them. They ended up having to cut ties from me because they was embarrassed and they was ashamed because I did nothing wrong to them. But they can no longer contain their jealousy and their envy that they had towards me. So they had to separate themselves from me. But it they were exposed to other people as well. And they might expose themselves by talking and lying on you and not telling the lying on you and spreading rumors when it's really going to make them look bad instead of making you look bad right and these people are they going to know it's a lie and i'm gonna go back and read something because it just dropped in my spirit um it's proverbs chapter 26 So verse, verse 19 says, "Is someone who lies to a friend, then say, I was just joking. Fire is go, I said I was just joking. Fire goes out without wood and cross them disappear when God so stops. All right. But. Okay. Remember, go back to that. Verse 18. Just as damaging as a madman shooting a deadly weapon is someone who lies to a friend and say, and then says, I was only joking. Y'all, these people are dangerous people. We got to understand we do have people who are passively aggressive that call ourselves friends, who are uh, people who will sit and tell lies um, on us. And thinking it's okay all that stuff is going to be exposed y'all in this season in this hour these are very very dangerous people and god wants this stuff to be revealed but when it get exposed it's going to be expo exposed in public all right so i love you guys i pray that you all have an amazing day and i will chat with you all later